Hi guys, it's Jay and welcome back to my channel and today I'm here with another book review and I am gonna review The Man Who Mistook His Wife for a Hat written by Oliver Sacks. The book is a compilation of different case studies conducted by Oliver Sacks of people with different mental deficits. It's not actually like me reviewing the book, it's more of a my thoughts on the book. I think it is a great book to read and I would recommend it to anyone who is interested in, you know, like working with people with disabilities or uh, who wants to know more about physical disabilities or like mental disabilities. I think it's a great book for anyone and everyone to read. The author of the book says that sometimes these people with different deficits have um, some skills or like some unique talents and he says that instead of uh, trying to support these people by helping them to improve those skills we say that those people should not have like any talents or like any specific skills and they should just like try to fit in into our, our society by learning bedtime man manners and like maintaining eye contact or like knowing how to use public transportation and stuff and the author of the book Oliver Sacks he says that uh, instead of doing that, we should help them become more skilled in whatever they do. Be it painting, be it listening to music, or like creating music, or like working with like, you know, some type, some kind of like numbers or like prime numbers, so that these people with different deficits can lead happier lives. Also the book makes us see and realize how subjective the definition of normalcy is. Whatever, say, I do is normal for me and say whatever my roommate does can be like abnormal and crazy and freaky for me, right? So the definition of normalcy is very subjective to begin with. So why are we imposing those standards to other people? Because for people who have uh, mental deficits, whatever life they lead is normal for them. So maybe they are happier that way, like happier living the life they have always known. Instead of trying to fit into our society. You'll see that I have a lot of problems with the concept of normalcy and fitting in. Yeah, those are my thoughts on this amazing book. Sometimes it was kind of hard for me to follow what the author was talking about, but you will um, get the general picture of each case and what happened to the human being portrayed in each case study. So I recommend this book to anyone and everyone, as I said before. Um, I think you're gonna enjoy it and it's gonna give you another perspective on viewing mental disability or like any kind of disability. This is it for this video. I think for my next video I'm gonna do um, a video called 10 or so books that I would definitely reread. I'm not sure like probably those kind of kinds of videos exist on YouTube but I'm gonna do that and hope that the idea is original. But yeah, um, so you can look forward to that and yeah, thank you guys for watching me. I hope you fi found my review useful and enjoyable. As I always say, do not forget that you are an amazing human being, beautiful inside and out. And don't forget to enjoy this sticky weather. Hopefully you have good AC, unlike me. But yeah, hope you guys are enjoying your summer, whatever you're doing at the moment, your internships, your jobs, your vacation, your summer classes. And see you next time.